Dissociation is normally triggered by intense fear and the loss of hope that you can be okay. It can be triggered by an event that is making you feel overwhelmed, scared, and defeated, or by a situation that brings you back to a moment where you felt that way previously. Imagine that you were always punished by someone when you got home late and drunk, and one day you have a couple of extra drinks and there are no taxis around and it's starting to be very late. All of a sudden you feel numb, confused, unable to remember anything. Even when you are single and living alone, your brain identifies the situation as one where you used to be afraid of and will set itself in action to mimic the way you used to respond, which means scared, overwhelmed, and dissociating. When someone dissociates, what it needs to be done is to bring the awareness that you are emotionally activated, that you need to do something about it. By noticing that you are dissociating, you are already doing something to stop it, then you could take a deep breath and move your body. Dissociation means that the parasympathetic nervous system is overworking, and you need to help your system by balancing it with some sympathetic activation. That means movement, and awareness of the present. Movement can be from standing up, opening and closing your fingers, go for a run, or do some jumping. The brain needs to receive the order that it should not go into dissociation because you are not in extreme danger. You need your cognition back, your orientation, your focus. Orienting yourself is good too, or talking to yourself as in, nobody is going to punish you for being late today, type of statement. That way you are also sending the signal to your brain that you are safe. If you have someone you trust, you can give that person a call and have some chit chat with them. Socially engaging can also make you feel safe and send the right message to the brain. What you have to avoid is feeling scared for being dissociating because that would make it worse. The more aware you are of that dissociation happens as a defense that you may not need in that moment, the faster you will bounce back into your normal functioning.